channel. I cannot believe that it's almost Christmas. Today is, I don't even know what day it is. Today is Friday the something if. Um, and Christmas is next week. That's insane. It's gone by so fast. Um, so Cooper and I are going to make a video on stocking stuffers for men. So I'm gonna tell my husband that he's not allowed to watch this video because I'm gonna go through everything I got in his stocking. Um, <clears throat> one of the things isn't here yet and something else I had to give him early because I'll, I'll go into that um, once I start going through everything in a stocking. So Cooper and I are gonna get started. All right, um, 12 times a charm. I'm uh, trying to record this video. My kids have been extra today. Cooper finally went down for a nap. He really needed it. Um, and Grayson is just being Grayson. So I'm going to start with the edible type um, stocking stuffers. And I'll let you know where everything is from. So we're going to start with... First, these original peanuts, they are beer nuts. They're salt and sweet, so those will be going in his stocking. Um, those are from the dollar store. Walmart also has a really good selection of like mixed nuts um, and different flavors too. Next, I got two mild Slim Jims to slip in there. These are also from the dollar store. I also got these from the dollar store. They are cookies and cream Hershey Kisses. He likes cookies and cream, so I'll probably just sprinkle those around in his stocking. Next, I got this adorable mini jar of Nutella. I think it's so cute. This is from Walmart and it's in the stocking stuffer Christmas um, section. I just thought it was cute. We'll probably end up giving it to Grayson, but I liked it. Ooh, I'm really excited about these. I found these at Ross. Um, these will make a really good stocking stuffer for people if you know they like hot sauce. The brand is called Swift Burn. Um, and they are like little sample sized. Well, they're pretty good size. You could probably get a couple uses out of them. Of uh, hot sauces. This one is habanero. There we go having trouble focusing. This one is cayenne hot sauce. And then next we have chipotle pepper hot sauce. So that is it for all the edible type things for his stocking. Um, usually I'll also add a favorite drink. Um, so we have something to sip on while we're opening up stockings and Christmas presents. So I'll probably grab a drink um, Christmas Eve or a little before, just so he has something to sip on. That's a little thing we picked up from Justin's mom that she likes to do. So moving on, I'm gonna move on to clothing type things for his stocking. First I got um, some underwear. This is the brand Pair of Thieves. I've heard amazing things about this. I follow a handful of influencers and they all said these are great. Um, the material is really good. I thought they only sold them at Target, but when I was at Walmart the other day, I found a whole end cap of this brand. So underwear is always a good idea. I also got him some socks, but um, I got those like a month or two ago and I hid them somewhere and I don't know where they are. So I need to try to find those. Uh, next for clothes, I got him four different kinds, uh, different colors of t-shirts, just super basic ones. They're Hanes, um, cause I think you can't have too many just t-shirts. So I got like a maroon, a forest green. I like this one. And then a black, and then this is like a, I don't know, a light green, I guess. So I'll probably roll those up and put some ribbon around them and put them in the stocking if they'll fit. If not, I'll just put them next to the stocking. That is all for 
clothing. We'll move on to miscellaneous. Okay, starting with the miscellaneous items, I got him this double wall vacuum travel mug. He got one like this last year from my sister and he uses it all the time for his coffee. So I picked this up a month or so ago and I like the color, it matches my kitchen wall. So that will go in his stocking. Next I got his favorite, oh, this is from Joanne by the way, Joanne Fabrics. Next I got a um, little black ice um, what is it called? Air freshener. Black Eyes is our favorite one, so that will be going in his stocking. Next, I got just a deck of playing cards. This is from the dollar store. We like to play rummy and stuff, and we can never find our cards. Then, okay, so a few weeks ago, I think a week or two ago, Justin lost his wallet. Um, and so can't find it anywhere, doesn't know where it could be. So I bought him a new wallet while I was out the other day and he went to the bank and finally canceled his cards, got new ones, got his new driver's license and everything. And then he texted me saying, after the bank, I'm gonna go to Walmart and get a new wallet. And I texted him back, I was like, well, what if Santa's planning on bringing you a wallet? Because I obviously just bought one. So I ended up giving him his wallet early. Uh, he has it with him right now. Um, but I got him this too. It's a tile, so it comes with one for your keys. And this is a tile um, that fits in your wallet. It looks like a credit card, slips in there. So if he loses his wallet again, he'll be able to track it on his phone. So I wish we had that before. Oh well, if he loses it again, we'll know where it is. Okay, I'm gonna move on to self-care stuff now, and this is the final part of the stocking. First things first, I got Justin these black dental picks from the dollar store, and I got him this ultra white Colgate toothpaste from the dollar store. I was gonna get him a new toothbrush too, but he got a new toothbrush uh, a few weeks ago. Um, it was like $230 for a freaking toothbrush. He, I don't know why he got a new one. Um, that was that expensive. He ordered it off of Amazon and it was $199. And then he bought like the 30, it was like $39 for the attachments, like replacement heads. So um, I got him some, toothpaste to go with his very expensive toothbrush. I also got a new toothbrush around the same time, a few days before actually, from the dollar store. So, we're not the same. Next, we are moving on to, I found this at TJ Maxx. It comes with scissors, uh, nail clippers, and a nail file. There's the big clipper and the small one, so. That was from TJ Maxx because he never knows where the nail covers are. I also found these at TJ Maxx. They are shower blasts. So the instructions say, um, step into the shower and place the blast beneath the steam of water, but not on the drain. Breathe deeply and enjoy the soothing steam swirls around you. So I think we'll, he'll mostly use these when he's sick. Um, I really wanted to get him some of these because last time he was sick, he couldn't find the Vicks Vapor Rub anywhere and it was a whole fiasco and I was thinking those would have been perfect. So we have them for next time and those are from TJ Maxx. Then I got, um, he wanted some lotion for Christmas. He ran out of them. I got him lotion from like Bath and Body Works a few years ago. And so I picked up some more. This was in a kit from Ross. So it comes with a body lotion, a face scrub. Um, doesn't want to focus. And hair and beard balm. Body scrub. 
and a big old thing of body soap. That's like huge. It smells so good. The set smells great. Um, and then 3 one body hair face wash. The scent is cedar wood. So yeah, that came in like a gift set. I like to buy gift sets and like take them apart um, as fillers instead of keeping them in the big box. So it smells great. This is from Ross. Great find. And then the last self care thing that I got was some unflavored CBD oil. He gets really bad panic attacks and anxiety attacks and has for about three years now. Um, he's tried like medication, not like consistently. And I keep telling him it's not gonna work if you don't take it consistently for like a month before you see it working. But anyway, that's besides the point. He also tried a CBD pen um, for a few days, but it freaked him out. He didn't like the idea of smoke in his lungs, so he stopped using that. So I decided to get him some CBD drops. Um, this is from Bath by Bex. They are in Spokane and they have an online website too. I'll link their website below. Um, when I worked at the Bean Bar in Coeur d'Alene, they were, the owners were regulars at the stand and we used their drops uh, for like a dollar. You could get some CBD drops in your coffee or drinks. Uh, they work great. The shipping was really fast, but if you are local, you can put in there like local and um, say if you want to meet somewhere or if you just want to go to Spokane to their shop to pick it up. They also sent a CBD chapstick too. So I'm going to put that in Justin's stocking as well. Um, that is all. Oh yeah, I lost the chapstick. So that's one of the things that I hid and I can't remember where it is. So that is all of the stocking stuffers for Justin. I don't know how I'm going to fit it all into his stocking, but I am going to try and I am very excited for Christmas. So I hope this video helped you out with thinking of some um, stocking stuffers for your husband or boyfriend or whoever you are looking for and I will link everything below that I can. So have a Merry Christmas.